I am back in one of my favorite locations, Hanover, Pennsylvania. I just arrived at yesteryear. This is my fourth stop of the day. I've spent $291 so far. I'm excited to get in here and see what they've restocked with since I've been out of town. All right, well, I made it scot-free out of a couple cases. However, look at this guy. Oh my gosh, he is adorable. $24.30. Super fair, but um, I wonder. Oh! oh. Knee huggers. What are they? $20 each and 30%. Oh my gosh. Let's see, this is why I knew. Kevin and Eric, how funny are they? Okay. Um,. I am, uh, oh my God. Whoa. Um, all right, let me uh, get it together here. So I've decided to go, oh, my camera's zoomed All right, there we go. That's better. I've decided to go about this strategically and just go one shelf at a time and kind of rack up what I'm interested in. I love the religious items, but not quite and the bone china hand is fun i've had it a few times though recently not that long ago um i love this uh bubble glass wall plaque that's amazing and it's like 21 dollars after the discount which is so cheap but not quite what i'm looking for today uh, oh my gosh, all the little old light sets, fantastic. I love the boxes. I've bought and sold lights in the past. It was kind of a pain, honestly. This is fantastic. 1960s plastic pine ball with sugared candy treats ready to hang. $9.30%, we're taking that. What a fun doodad. So I did do the math on this and uh, where it is a super easy price for me to make profit on. I've bought a few things like it recently and I haven't even finished listing all of it. So I'm gonna let it go. Uh, this is funny little <laughs> googly eyes. We love googly eyes. These are hobbyist napkin holders, kind of fun. Not quite, I like this planter too. What are we, what's happening down here? Oh my gosh, I hope you can't hear my stomach growling. Oh, cute, but not quite for me. I don't know why I did that. I'm gonna put them back the way they were. You know what? Actually, we don't like them there. We're gonna we're gonna make them more obvious. There we go. And I bought her last time um, another one of these. This one had a little damage on the face. And then over here, I love the beaded flowers. Those are fantastic. Um, I have a couple bouquets of beaded flowers that I've been uh, holding on to and I decided in my move to sell them. I have yet to list them, so I'm not gonna get more. Uh, the knee hugger there, gonna let that one go. Um, this is pretty fantastic, but it's got those stickers that make me a little nervous. Kevin and Eric are pretty great, uh, but... <laughs> Let's see. I am crawling like a crazy person. Let me get up, hold on. <clears throat> All right, so these guys are $20 each. So at $14 each, super cheap, especially if you're buying as a collector, but I'm a little greedy when it comes to uh, reselling these guys. Hmm. Uh, the left in nurse, is that left in? Yeah, it's a, it's a newer one than I prefer. Oh my gosh, look at that fabulous celluloid toy. Now I still have my basket stashed. Um, I decided to uh, end there basically, so I'm gonna keep looking around the other aisles. I see a Christ piggy bank. Uh, I left one of these behind the other day in Pittsburgh because it's such bad crazing. $30 is about retail. Oh, I love these. I think they're so fantastic. Good grief. Look at that wedding basket. 
Oh, that is killer. I just realized I'm uh, roaming free without a basket. Look at the little choir boys. Those are cute. Um, oh, and these ones too. The carolers are $9 for the pair. They are missing their trim there. Oh my gosh, look at this freaking January angel. She is so cute. She does have a chipped flower. She's still steel. Kind of tempting. Um, hmm. Oh, there's one of those uh, Santa Claus music boxes. I think those are so sweet. I picked up one similar earlier today in uh, Gettysburg. The left and duck is fun. And of course, you know I love the little kittles back there. Ooh, so many fun Christmas shakers. I like the hobbyist Santas actually. Um, and of course this set is always a good one. Uh, I have had it twice recently though, and that's about what mine sold for. Hmm. Shut the front door. Look at this piggy bank. How stinking cute is that? Nine dollars. I kind of love him. Hong Kong. Oh, now it comes to seven dollars and sixty-five cents. I personally want to pick this up. I've bought a lot of stuff today, and I haven't finished the aisles. I might come back for it, but I don't think it would sell that quick just because of the wear. Um, it would definitely sell, and I could definitely make money on it. And I think it's personally adorable, especially with Valentine's Day around the corner. But I'm just trying to be super careful with my move coming up. I don't want to bite off more than I can chew per se. All right, and I'm also now noticing this thumper figurine. This is adorable. It's only $6, $7, let's say. And look at these little plastic ducks. How cute are they? Oh, I love stuff like this. Hmm. I'm gonna get this. I can't resist this little face. Nope, I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna come back. My basket is still in the other aisle. This is kind of a strange sleigh. Huh. It's like a cross between Napco and Lennox. I love this chalkware sailor too. And the funny little cows. Gosh, so much cute stuff. That pig set's fun too. Oh, I love the little drummer boy. It's a shame he's broken. Although I will say I probably wouldn't pick it up anyway. I personally try to stay away from these because um, I, nine times out of 10, somehow managed to damage these music boxes in my office. I am trying to remember why I left this uh, Cardinal set salt and pepper shaker last time I was here. I'm pretty sure I did. Maybe I didn't and I'm making that up, but they're $4.50 and 20% off. And I feel like somebody made a comment about it. And I was like, you know what? They're not wrong. Um, I'm gonna scoop these up. I love the Santa tripe, but these little guys are what caught my attention so cute. Now, this is something that I would have in my home. That is fantastic. Oh, I love that. I need to go back and get my basket. Um, I've bypassed like half the, the boost because uh, I'm already sick of carrying these. Oh my gosh, I'm grabbing this before I do anything else. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and throw these things in my basket and uh, work my way back. I am back. So here's what I'm gonna do. I am second guessing just a little. I think it's mostly just because I'm being cheap. So I'm gonna put these back. I'm gonna finish the rest of the antique mall and then I'm gonna come back and uh, see how I feel since I've already kind of done a very chaotic semi half loop. Well, I'm already kicking myself for putting them back. So uh, we'll just see what happens at the end. This is fantastic, by the way. This choir boy, oh my gosh, and it's Christ as is. Okay, I was like, why is this $6? Wait, why is it $6? What's as is? Gosh, am I that tired? I don't think I am. I think I'm just having a hard time figuring out what's as is about it. The trick was you had to hold it upside down uh, and to the right. You see there's a giant nick out of it, so I'm gonna put that back. Here's one of those Italian dishes that looks like uh, Holt Howard. 
Hmm, love the little blow mold. That Santa music box is fantastic. Ah, Valentine's. Hmm, nothing uh, I haven't seen before. Okay, but all of this. Oh, I love these kinds of dishes. These tin uh, ashtrays are so fun. I've bought and sold them in the past. Uh, they don't sell for much, but they're an easy add-on stocking stuffer. This is cute. Is this Fitz and Floyd? Fritz and Floyd? I, I, can never, I can never remember which one it is when I'm out in the world. Hmm. I love the assemblages they make. Uh, all right. I'm gonna, oh my gosh, how cute. Look at you. I'm gonna get my, oh my, ah. I'm gonna get my basket. So, <laughs> oh, I was just kind of like spaced out staring at the figurines and I came to and I saw this. Um, That's hilarious. <laughs> uh, I'm like on the fence if I should get it because it's weird and hilarious, but, hmm. I think I'm gonna pass. It's a, it might be a little bit much. Oh my gosh, I love these uh, candy striped ornaments. I don't do bulbs like that though. They're way too easily broken. All right, let's see here. Oh, so cute. Look at the little angels. Um, I bought a couple of these style. These are the styrofoams. I looked at these last time. I'm not gonna get those. What is this little? diorama that's sweet hmm, yeah i'm gonna leave those but i'm really interested in what's happening over here i love this uh vintage tree 32 looks handmade but it's got definitely vintage ornaments on it very cute um this is what i was uh originally going for i have never seen this left in christmas girl before 24, I'm gonna assume, is about retail. Um, maybe a little bit less, but uh, I don't think that one's for me. And of course, the Napco reindeer. I picked up one of those earlier today. Love the mugs, kind of Holt Howardy. What's this little? Oh my gosh, I love that. That's so freaking cute. Snow globe. And the snowman. 22, pretty average. Oh my gosh, look at you. That is so fun. I love that guy. He is $20, the arrangement's $3. Don't worry, I, if he was $3, I wouldn't have put him back. Um, that's about uh, all you can get out of that. I'm so distracted, there's so much happening here. I've really not made it far. <laughs> oh, look at these sweet snowmen. Those are uh, definitely on the newer side though, unfortunately for me. All right, I have made it back. I'm gonna give a quick scan to the costume jewelry here, which usually isn't my thing. I actually really like this glass bird. Oh my gosh, $8? That's so cheap. Um, these cats are kind of neat. Japan. Whoa, tigers. That's cool. Five dollars each. Gosh, I'm I'm like on the fence between just completely ripping and letting loose and getting a bunch of knickknacks, or uh, keeping it the way I'm supposed to and only buy what I think will sell instantly as I um am getting prepared to move and have bought so many things this week. Ah, look at you. Twelve dollars. That's about what I'd sell him for too. I love those guys. Now I know this is uh, newer than I usually like. I kind of liked its uh, funny expression though. Here's more of those face mugs. 12 bucks, cheap. Now I do really adore everything about this uh, battery op Santa for $15, but I am gonna leave him behind and stick true to my no battery op rule. And plus it's a little bit larger than I'd like, even though his face is great. Um, it would have to be in a bigger box and I would want to ship that in. What's going on over here? Okay, not what I thought. I thought it was salt and pepper shakers. Ah, flocked Santa, $3.50. And 
almost all his flocking is there. Perfect. I'm gonna grab him. Um, obsessed with the witch candle. Good grief, that's cool. Um, how cute are you? Oh, I love him. Um, what was I doing over here? Oh yeah, I was looking at the scotch decanter. <clears throat> is it a scotch decanter or just a generic decanter? I don't usually buy these. A couple times I have, they haven't sold well, but I just think they're so fun. Rye. Oh, I guess they all um, have different alcohols on them. Hmm. I just spaced out. Let me uh, regroup. All right, I cannot lie. I'm starting to lose steam and space out a little bit. So I'm going to finish up this aisle and go back take those give those glasses one last look and uh, I looked at that last time I love the shape of that and then get out of here take a little break before I head to Black Rose all right I'm back at that booth where I found that little Santa here um this is kind of interesting Oops. hmm uh cute but not quite uh, I think this is one of those uh I don't really buy and sell those honestly I don't have much luck with them what is going on over here? Let's see. I am starting to lose steam, like I said, so I feel like I'm gonna rewatch this and be like, oh my gosh, I missed so much stuff. Love the leopard. I looked at him last time. I decided to pass. More Hazel Atlas strawberries, 12 bucks. I got two for $4 each earlier today. That was lucky. What is this funny turtle? Oh my gosh. How funny is he, Hong Kong? How much is this? $12. That's probably about what I'd get for that. Well, like I said, I'm starting to lose steam. But I couldn't help but notice these. Um, they came from my friend B's booth. $8 each and 20% uh, off is $6.40 a pop. They need bulbs, but uh, I think... Uh, I think we're gonna grab these. We love these Hong Kong plastic flowers and they got glitter and looks like they're in really good condition. If all they need is a light bulb, I'd trust her and um, I'm gonna do it. Oh, I love these cookie cutters. How fun are they? Hmm. Tumble snowmen. Funny, uh, that's how my hair looks right now. Good grief. This one's a little glittery santa that's adorable too what is this oh i thought it was a heart at first all right so i just can't let them go for some reason and uh i'm now seeing that there's a second set of four i'm not sure how i missed that before but i can't let them go i'm just gonna go ahead and get them i'm not gonna make as much as i'd like off them but uh they're so unique and the only set that's online is three digits and eight of them so i think it'll be a fun individual item like i said i am kind of tapping out uh, i'm gonna do one last quick breeze through and then um check out and i will see you guys uh outside gosh they're so fun well i uh <laughs> i definitely shopped my little heart out in there it's dark out now and um it's been 120 dollars I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna go over to Black Rose and then I am definitely calling it a night.